everyone, I'm Marcy with Murals by Marcy, and today I'm going to be painting a mural of a castle in the nursery of a soon-to-be-born baby girl. To save time, I'm going to be using a projector, and I'm going to project my image onto the wall and trace the outline of my mural in pencil first. Now, having a projector is a real luxury. Of course, you can always freehand your mural. I usually like to draw it out in pencil first, uh, but even at that, you draw, you erase, uh, you're just gonna need to make sure that you have plenty of touch-up paint to cover over all your mistakes. So again, having a projector is a real luxury, and if I wanna move it a little to the left, a little to the right, make it bigger or smaller, it's no big deal. Now I'm going to be using just regular acrylic paint that you find at the craft store, as well as some of these paint samples that I bought of some of the paint colors that I'm gonna be using more. I just wanted to make sure I didn't run out. So let's go ahead and get started. See, that didn't take long at all so now I'm ready to start painting so I've got my water handy as well as a wet rag and I'm gonna get started pretty much got the castle done and took a break so today I'm back and ready to finish it off and I'm going to be adding some clouds to this because when the homeowners originally approached me they showed me a photo of a castle that was sort of floating in the clouds now this is a perfect job for an airbrush because an airbrush can create some very realistic looking clouds but since I don't have one I'm going to improvise and this is what I use just a regular old sponge now I dipped it in water wrung it out but it's still nice and moist and I'm going to dip it into my white paint and then just rub it onto the wall. Now at this point if you wanted to add pink or yellow to it you could also do that because clouds sometimes have a little bit of color in them but I'm going to start with just a plain white. Before I show you what it looks like all done, let's take one more look at what this room looked like before. And here it is after. You can see what a difference a little mural can make in a nursery. Well, this castle, I can tell you, is going to look a whole lot better once the little princess arrives. Can you just picture her? Well, I can anyway. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out my other blog entries at Murals by Marcy on Facebook and MuralsbyMarcy.com and hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.